Good morning, welcome back. We're doing another travel vlog. Back to back travel vlogs and I am exhausted. So the last vlog I went to Virginia to see my husband at his army training and I got home yesterday and I am about to <laughs> take a road trip to Philly to meet my best friend Lily there. It's kind of perfect. She's in Pittsburgh. I'm in New England and we're just gonna like meet right in Philly and it's about four or five hours for each of us in the car. So I got up early. I walked the dog. I gave him a fresh bath. I'm all packed. I am 1000% overpacked for this. 1000%. <laughs> but I'm like, you never know what kind of outfit pics we're going to want to take. This is like a much needed girls trip for me and Lily. We haven't we haven't gone on a girls trip in forever. I think this is our first girls trip, just the two of us actually. So it's gonna be super duper nice. I will vlog as much as I can, but more than anything, I'm just happy to hang out with her. I went ahead and did my makeup this morning just so like I was good for the day. I did like my full glam of this is gonna last all day. I even took out the double wear. I haven't used double wear in so long and I actually feel like this color match is one of the best I've had in a while. I'm like, why have I not been reaching for this? I really just don't know. I am honestly procrastinating right now. Oh, I'm tired. I am very tired. I've been sleeping really well, but like traveling for some reason is just draining as all heck. But I've got on a nice comfy outfit, this like old cropped cozy sweater, and then these Abercrombie um, wide leg sweats. And I recently got these like cute little slippers at Target. They're so cute. You already know I will link everything I wear down below. But what do you think, Bruno? You want to go on a road trip? Your first road trip. Are you ready for your first road trip? Your first road trip. First stop, we got to get you a pup cup and mama a matcha. I dried him like 80% of the way from his bath. And then I'm just going to, I'm going to put the heat on in the car and we can get cozy. We can get cozy. Many hours later. All right, our first rest stop. Are you ready to take a little break? You ready to take a little break? <laughs> I just went pee. And now I'm going to walk Bruno. <laughs> Thankfully, there's like a field over there and a lot of people are walking their dogs. I've been Marco Poloing with Lily this whole time. And it looks like we're both gonna get there around the same time, which is great. Let's go take a little walk. You want some water? You want some water? We just went for a little walk. You such a good boy. You did a good boy. <laughs> good job. Okay. First stop complete. On to the next. drinking, peeing, pooping moment. I'm gonna go for a little walk. <laughs> You're doing such a good job. All right, you guys, we are in Philadelphia. Um, this ride was so easy. The dog has been amazing. Uh, I just got off the highway. The ride was interesting. It was a lot of um, on and off highways. I don't know, it was a very random ride, but it kept me entertained. Um, last night I laminated and dyed my eyebrows and <laughs> I think I left the dye in. So like when I, okay, when I took the dye off, it looked good. It looked like a medium brown because I like it to match my dark roots. Um, and I don't know if I took it off all the way or what, but it darkened even more overnight. My eyebrows are almost black, so... Alrighty, <laughs> I know you did such a good job. We stopped every like two-ish hours, sometimes a little less. Um, and he went to the bathroom. We got some food and water. He did a great job on this car ride. Um, I know we've been in the car a long time, um, but it went by really quick because I was chatting with either Yar or Lily. We actually Marco Poloed like the whole drive, so we got to uh, kind of feel like we were driving together, which made it go by so so quick. So I can't wait to show you guys the hotel. Um, we're staying at So Sweet Rittenhouse area. I've never stayed over there. I've been to Philly once on a work trip 
and I got to sightsee and all of that. Um, Philly is awesome. I really like it here. I don't think I've been to this area before, so it'll be fun to explore. Um, we're only here tonight, the full day tomorrow, and then leaving the next morning. So we're just here for two nights. It's a pretty quick trip just to um, hang out and have some girl time. But it's kind of perfect. We did not, like, well, we, like, loosely planned getting here around the same time. But it worked out perfectly. We're both going to get here, like, within five minutes of each other. And we both drove five hours. So, amazing. Let's go. show you it's so cute hi what do you think well we've been chilling for a minute so mm -hmm. yes mm -hmm. lily's here we made it within five minutes of each other it was perfect you did it perfect so here's the entrance we've got a cute mirror here and then on the left is the bedroom which is so cute i love this wallpaper and i love the different tones of uh color here so nice Gorgeous, gorgeous bedroom. Boop. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, that's too much. Hi. We're going to take you for a nice walk. Yes, we are. This place is great because it has, it's like an apartment. So we've got a really beautiful kitchen. My favorite part, though, are these French doors all along. They open so you can get some nice fresh air. Cute little bar cart. Yeah. And we're like right in the action, which is great. Like we can totally walk around, like the perfect location. It was like one street over from the parking garage. Um, we've got this gorgeous table, a nice little desk situation here with some artwork. I love that tree, very my, very my aesthetic in here. I love it. I'm like obsessed with the artwork. Right? I love that. I know. It's so cute. And then this. Um, light that comes off the wall. So cool. Mm. Yes. And then we've got a little sitting out area over here. This adorable fireplace with the mirror, TV, couch, more of the French doors. It's, it really is a beautiful space. And then here is the bathroom. So gorgeous. You guys know I love the modern black and white aesthetic. Looks so pretty. Definitely a great location if you're coming to Philly. So I'll link the hotel down below if you guys are looking for a great spot to stay. We're walking Bruno in Rittenhouse Park, I think it's called. Yeah. It's really cute. He's very happy to be here. Bruno is enjoying the city. We just got to this coffee place. Lily's grabbing a coffee. And then Lily and I are gonna go out to dinner while he chills at the apartment. Guys, we're back at the room and I just need to show you, we stopped in like a little store. Um, it was really small, it was just us, so I felt awkward vlogging, but look at these earrings I got. Look at these, they're from a brand called Peter and June. They're so cute. Like, they're I'm obsessed. Also, we haven't really said hi to you officially, but we're together. Hey. And Bruno's doing good, he's totally adapted. Um, so we got him settled in and now we're going to go and get some dinner. All right, this is where we're going for dinner. Pietro's. They have gluten-free pizza for this gluten-free queen. Let's see if it's good, like the reviews. Super cute in here. Gluten-free options. So good. So we'll see. Huge update. Lily loves the gluten-free pizza. So this is the spot. This is so good. Yay! And we got meatballs. Those are bomb too. Yay! And that's not just the wine talking. Like It's bomb. Lily and I stopped at CVS to get water. You know me, I live on jerky. That's the protein blast, honey. It's all locked up. <laughs> I think because it's expensive now. I mean, that's $18. $18. For jerky? For jerky. Jerky ain't that good. Jerky ain't that good. Guys, Bruno loves Lily so much. Do you love your auntie? 
Oh my god, we've just been cuddling and cuddling. <laughs> the little tail his little tail wag. Oh you love oh your auntie. God. You love your auntie. You love your auntie. Time for the last bathroom break before bed. Before bed. See you in the morning. Good morning. It's the next morning. My eyebrows are so dark, it's borderline embarrassing. Um, but I'm walking the dog at Rittenhouse Park, I think it is. And it's so dog friendly. There's so many people here walking their dogs. Bruno is in heaven. Did you have a good time? You slept so good. Oh, another dog over there. <laughs> Bruno loves it here. He's like, I want to stay here. So we're walking to breakfast and everything over here is just so aesthetic. It really is cute over the here. The fashion here too, like I keep seeing all of these like super trendy people. I love just it. Just like it has a lot of New York vibes over here. It, it really does. does. It does. So but like not so hectic. Insane. Yeah. <laughs> yes, a more mild New York. It's nice. This is where we're going for breakfast. Green Eggs Cafe. All right, we had breakfast and we are walking over to a market now. I can't remember the name of it, but it's in my phone. <laughs> so much beautiful architecture. Love it. All right, Reading Terminal Market. Yep, it's right in here. Ooh, this is so fun. We'll just do a loop, just check it all out. Oh, I love places like this. <laughs> it smells so good. This is so fun. I love it in here. Here. Cheese steaks, dude. I want Lily to have a cheese steak while we're here. luminaries with like the flowers in them they're made of wax i believe those are so cool yeah if we were staying here longer you and i would buy so much cheese oh my god that's a ton of bacon oh my god so many flavors i bought some tea from that place oh pickles no, you don't know. I have a pickle obsession lately. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I want pickles. I could go for like an apple cider. Catch a fall vibe. Oh, damn. They're beautiful. These are beautiful. They're just like stunning. Okay, you guys, we decided to do a bus tour so we can like see as much of the city since we're just here today and we go home tomorrow so it's gonna be perfect and it's right across from the market so we just popped over here and we're definitely gonna sit on top <laughs> hell yeah we made it on the bus the first bus was full we had to wait like an hour <laughs>
guys. So we went on the bus tour. It, it is hop on and hop off. <laughs> I thought she was saying hi to us. <laughs> Hello. So now we are in the Gaberhood. It's called the Gaberhood and I absolutely love it. It's really cute. I got some clips of it on the bus. But we're gonna walk to a gluten-free bakery for a little and see what we pass on the way. It's so cute. I love it over here. Hi. Guys, there's a dog daycare. There's one that looks like Bruno. Oh my God. Okay, you guys, it is many hours later. We had so much fun on the bus tour. That's like just such a quintessential thing to do if you're in a new spot. Um, it just helps you get the lay of the land and see everything if you're somewhere in a short time. But we had a really good time. Uh, we had a really good um, tour guide. He was wonderful. Shout out Mike, I think was the same. Yeah. Anyway, um, we came back here like around four. We were out for a really long time. We went out at nine. So we came back, walked the dog, chilled and we've been here for a couple hours and now we're gonna head to dinner. I touched up and darkened my eyeshadow a little. The Estee Lauder Double Wear, I busted it back out. This foundation does not budge. I miss this, I love this. It stayed on all day through bus rides, a little bit of sweat, like, oh, so good. I added a little more bronzer for the nighttime look. Um, I'm wearing a monochromatic brown look with some snake booties, snake print. So we're gonna go to this really cute restaurant tonight called The Love, and it's such a vibe. We're both really excited for our cheese board. So let's go. All right, guys, this place is so cute. We're on the second floor and we love it. We just got the cheese board. We're both just swooning over this bathroom. Like obsessed with this bathroom. This whole, this whole restaurant, top? this whole restaurant was 10 out of 10. The love. It's, it was so good. We love it here. We, we love, love the love. love. <laughs> good morning. I'm in this same sweater because it's the only sweater I brought. <laughs> like I have long sleeve shirts, but in the morning it's chilly. Afternoon it's warm. So I'm wearing this again to walk the dog. We had a chill night. After the dinner, we came home and watched The Office and just chatted for a while, walk the dog, the usual. So I'm walking Bruno. But at least still asleep and we never made it to the gluten-free bakery yesterday so i found one nearby i'm gonna go get her some pastries while she's sleeping because i feel bad that we never made it yesterday um and we're just gonna get up and out because we have long drives home so hopefully they're gonna have some good gluten-free stuff i can grab for her bruno met a lot of dogs today at the park he had a good time we like to play with lots of dogs Okay, I was able to get her a coffee and I have um, a pastry in my pocket. They only have one, so I hope it's good. All right, we're packed up. Goodbye, hotel. You were amazing. Let's go home. Many hours later. All right, we're at the first rest stop of our trip. We're halfway home, about two hours in. Doing good. Bruno's been sleeping. Sleeping. I um, can't find my sunglasses, so I'm wearing Yarmans. I'm straight up rocking the dad look right now because <laughs> he left his sunglasses in my glove box and mine are buried somewhere deep within my tote bag. So I'm like, these are actually really nice. <laughs> they make everything like so technicolored. So, all right, I am going to walk him along this little grassy patch and then I'm gonna go in and use the bathroom and potentially grab myself lunch. They have a Chipotle. I was like, I could get a little kid's meal or something, but I don't know. We'll see. Many hours later. Back home. It's warm today, so I came home and put on shorts and a t-shirt. I don't know what's going on. It's like 75. <laughs> New England, am I right? But my mom is coming over now because we're gonna watch Love Island because I'm like tired from traveling, but also... It's three o'clock and what am I gonna do the rest of the day? So, hey Bruno. Do you wanna see grandma? Come on, I see grandma. The tail's wagon. He knows grandma's here. There he goes. I hear him like freaking out.
<laughs> you remember me, huh? You remember sleeping on my bed? You hogged the bed. <laughs> you a bad hog. Oh, you're such a good boy. <laughs> and then he does zoomies because he gets so excited. Guys, look at Bruno. He's got his... You love your grandma. Look at him. He's as good as that in my lap. Oh my God, he loves you. He's like my baby. Your baby. Good morning. It's the next day. I am gonna start a new vlog and end this one here so I can edit it for y'all, but I hope you enjoyed. We had so much fun and I got as much footage as I can, but I think it's, I think it's a decent vlog, but back to the normal vlogs in the next one. I love you, bye.